Welcome back folks to our third tutorial in this series and uh, let's continue from where we left off in the last tutorial we added this hero section so now let's add our text image section so let's go to custom fields and here under flexible content hit edit and let's click edit here again and then if we were to scroll down um, here we have our, our layout. This is our first uh, section, the hero in our layout. So now let's add another section in our layout. We want to add a text image section. So we clicked on add new and this appeared now. So in label, let's click text dash image and tab over and you'll see that you get this text image. Let me get rid of this guy. We'll create him later. So text image we're doing right now. So let's click on add field. And the first field within that, we want to create um, a WYSIWYG editor. So, but first let's label this. This is on the left, we want text. So let's call left text, tab over, and you'll see that it says left text. The field type, we want it to be a WYSIWYG editor right here. And what else? Uh, the, let me see, give me one second here. So we want this section to be 50% because we're gonna have text on one side and image on the other side. So we want it to take up 50%. Let's click on add field. And here we're gonna call this uh, right image. Why did I put the dash on one and not the other? We, I put left, no I didn't, that's fine. That's fine, I'm confusing myself. So right image, text, I mean tab, and the field type we want here is a uh, image. And under the value, we, we, you have the option uh, as to what how it's returned. We want it to return the image URL. In the preview size, I'm gonna select large, 750 by 420. And for the size of this uh, subsection, we're gonna put 50%. And now all we have to do is add the RCSS section. So click on add again. And this we're gonna call it, uh, let me see, CSS class. And the field type is gonna be a text section and we want it to take a whole line. So let's put 100 and let's save this. And let's go back to our page. Why do I have that twice? That's, that doesn't matter. Let's go here to home. And if we were to minimize this section and let's click on add and now we can put a text image section. So uh, let's put in the image first. What that, I think I had a cheesecake for the first one. So let's select that, select it. And then let me just grab some lorem ipsum. So let's paste that right here. And it's like that under the text uh, tab. If you wanted to do it on the visual tab, you can do it also. And then CSS class for now, we will leave it empty. And now let's update that first of all. Okay. And now we have two sections. We have text image and image text uh, is gonna be the next one. So we have our first hero section here. We have text image and that's it for this tutorial. In the next tutorial, like I said, I'm gonna show you how to create the image text section. So I hope you like this tutorial. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe and check out my webpage wpbasics.org and I'll catch you in the next tutorial. Bye.